And we know that if our earthly house of this dwelling be dissolved, that we have a building of God, a house not made with hands, everlasting in heavens. For why in this thing we mourn, co coveting to be clothed above with our dwelling, which is of heaven? If nevertheless we be found <coughs> clothed and not naked, for why be that? For why we that be in this tabernacle sorrow within and be heavied, for that we will not be despoiled, but be clothed above, that that thing that is deadly be sopped up of life. But who is it that maketh us into this same thing, God? that gave to us the earnest, either wed of the Spirit. Therefore we be hardy always, and know that while we be in this body, we go in pilgrimage from the Lord, for we walk by faith and not by clear sight. But we be hardy and have good will, more to be in pilgrimage from the body and to be present to God. And therefore we strive, whether absent, whether present to please him, for it behooveth us all to be showed before the throne of Christ, that every man tell the proper things of the body, as he hath done, either good, either evil. Therefore, we witting the dread of the Lord, counsel men, for to God we be open, and I hope that we be open also in your consciousness, consciences. We commend not us ourselves, we commend not ourselves again to you, but we give to you occasion to have glory for us that ye have to them that glory in the face and not in the heart. For either we be mind past, for either we by mind pass to God, either we be sober to you. For the charity of Christ driveth us, guessing this thing, that if one died for all, then all were dead. And Christ died for all, that they that live, live not now to themselves, but to him that died for them and rose again. Therefore we from this time Know no man after the flesh, though we know Christ after the flesh, but now we know not. Therefore, if any new creature is in Christ, the old things be passed. Lo, all things be made new, and all things be of God, which reconciled to us to him by Christ, and gave to us the service. And God was in Christ, reconciling to him the world, not reckoning to them their guilts, and put it in us the world of the word of reconciling. Therefore, we use message for Christ, as if God admonisheth by us. We beseech you for Christ, be ye reconciled to God. God the Father made him sin for us, which knew not sin, that we should be made righteousness of God in him.